Breaking news, an old military plane crashes in San Joaquin County with three people on board. What we're learning tonight. As a, as a person, as a woman, as a daughter, as a mother, I mean, I think we're all feeling this sense of loss in community. Tributes tonight honoring the late Supreme Court Justice. How the community is remembering Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Four kids should be going home to their parents today, and they're not, and, and, and I, I, that upsets me. He's a competitor, but he wasn't a sore loser. He was a person of integrity. And the Stockton community grieving the loss of a star athlete killed in a car crash with three other people. This is KCLA 3 News on My 58. We begin with breaking news. And that breaking news is out of San Joaquin County where an old military style plane crashed in an open field in Stockton just after 730 tonight. It happened in the area of Roberts Road and Muller Road. The San Joaquin County Sheriff's Office says that the three people on board the North American B-25 bomber were all taken to a nearby hospital in unknown conditions. An active investigation remains at the scene. We have a crew near the crash gathering more details. We'll be sure to update you as that information comes into our newsroom. And we are also following the tributes tonight in remembrance of the late Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg. People across Northern California honoring the justice who paved the way for many women. She died yesterday after a battle with cancer. She was 87 years old. KCRA 3 Stephanie Lynn is following a vigil in her honor tonight, which started at the federal courthouse in Sacramento. She joins us live with what she's seen right now. Stephanie. Hey, Walter, we're just outside of the Capitol building. We're just behind us here. That vigil does continue to grow. A memorial there continuing to grow with people paying their respects to the late Justice Ginsburg. Now, we have some video to show you from earlier today. You can see that the crowd is quite significant and lot.